YSU, Music Artists, the Public Library, and the National Theater are providing some awesome entertainment to get you through the stay-at-home order. We'll tell you all about it on today's Daily Buzz. Today's Business Journal Daily Buzz is brought to you by 717 Credit Union. For the past few weeks, the internet has been overflowing with amazing content to keep everyone entertained. We give you the details on some of them in our After Hours report. The After Hours Report is sponsored by Eastern Gateway Community College. With more than 35 programs, EGCC can help you with your career preparation and transfer plans. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of the After Hours Report Quarantine Edition. For those of us stuck at home, it looks like we're not going to be leaving for quite some time. But every day, people, organizations, and businesses are putting out new and awesome content streaming right into your home via the World Wide Web. And one of those things is a way to see virtually any kind of art. On Youngstown State University's YouTube channel, you can check out a brand new series by the Cliff College of Fine and Performing Arts. It's called C3, or Cliff Creative Connections. The series features a collection of video and audio vignettes with performances and presentations by students and faculty. One of the latest additions is Kibby Con Lippmann's performance of In Manus Tuus on the cello. <laughs> Throughout the rest of the semester at YSU, you'll also be able to see student exhibitions, senior projects, and recitals. You can find these videos just by searching Youngstown State University on YouTube. There are also a lot of music artists, local, regional, and national, performing live right on their Facebook pages. Hey everybody! Um, today is Samantha Fish Friday on Facebook. For example, Samantha Fish is going live every Friday at noon. The traveled hearts ache to feel it. So be sure to look up your favorite artists to find out when they'll be going live next. Another place you can find a lot of great entertainment is at the Public Library of Youngstown in Mahoning County. And yes, I know their building is closed, but their website isn't. By going to libraryvisit.org, you gain access to everything the library has to offer. Library Executive Director Amy Fafarik says you can even get a library card through the website if you don't have one already. It's a simple process. You just need to put in your name and address information and you'll get uh, a temporary barcode right away and then we'll actually email you an actual barcode. Normally we would mail you the card, um, but we're holding on to those until our staff who's doing this has access to mail and library postage and all of that kind of good stuff. Not only does LibraryVisit.org offer a huge selection of ebooks, as well as audiobooks, movies, and music. It also offers a ton of awesome resources for businesses, like Lynda.com training courses and Reference USA for market research. Gale databases, we have a lot of supportive databases, whether it's creating business plans or, um, or job skills. If you want to know more about what the library has to offer, be sure to check out the 3 Minutes with interview at businessjournaldaily.com. If you're really missing the theater scene, then there's more good news. National Theater is streaming a free show on their YouTube channel every Thursday. The new campaign is called National Theater at Home. Tonight, you can catch One Man, Two Governors, featuring James Corden. He's big bones. And how did he get big bones? All the usual, nature, nurture. Partly genetic, partly pies. <laughs> Yes, the internet really does bring us all together, without bringing us all together, if you know what I mean. By the way, while you're surfing the interwebs, there's also a ton of great content at AfterHoursYoungstown.com, like all the latest entertainment news, as well as our On the Menu and Flight Crew series. Be sure to check out Guy Destolfo's column where he says while everything seems empty right now with a lack of activity and events, the rescheduling of this year's Wonderstruck Festival in Cleveland to September 12th and 13th Seems like the light at the end of the tunnel for him. Thanks for the positive vibes, guy. 
And thanks so much to you for joining me for this week's After Hours Report. Be sure to head over to AfterHoursYoungstown.com and sign up for our weekly Entertainment Digest email to learn when your favorite events are being rescheduled and so much more. Also, be sure to visit BusinessJournalDaily.com for all the latest news. I hope you all have an amazing weekend and I will see you all next week. Now to play us out, here's Black Wolf and the Thief performing Money Left Over. Just fine with these holes in my shoes. I even look like I belong in a twenty-dollar suit. You talk to me like we're the same. You even call me your brother. But take a look around here. One of these things is not like the other. The After Hours Report is sponsored by Eastern Gateway Community College. With more than 35 programs, EGCC can help you with your career preparation and transfer plans. 717 Credit Union. Business services designed to meet your daily needs. Commercial loans, business deposits, merchant and payroll services. 717 Credit Union. It's knowing you were treated right every time.